The Standing Committee on Public Accounts says the Road Accident Fund is in a shambles. Scopa conducted an oversight visit to the RAF Centurion offices and Chairperson Mshleko Nchlengwa has concluded that there needs to be a full forensic investigation. The entity's board has been described as unfit for purpose. ENCA senior reporter Avi Wemtila tells us more. I'm at the basement parking of the road accident fund, but this is not the only function. Just across this side, thousands of boxes that are supposed to be claims are stuck in what is supposed to be a storage. Now, let's find out from a member of the Standing Committee on Public Accounts uh, what exactly is happening here, Ma. This is a storage, according to them. This is their storage where they store their documents. But the offices themselves, they, what they are subjecting their workers to the environment is not it's not conducive at all. Um, there is no furniture. Um, there are no chairs. There are no no tables. Um, the morale of the staff is very low. The the, the, the system itself is 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 more manual. Um, documents are lying around everywhere. Um, the, the, there is no coherence. Um, of the, 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 the document trail from one point to another. It's, it will be very difficult to trace even the progress of a claim. The offices are no different. It's just boxes upon boxes with thousands of claims that are clearly difficult to track. It's painful to hear the outcry from officials here, will you rescue us? And I think South Africans are waiting for their claims, as Honorable Van Menen was saying, but they don't know the real environment or what is going on. There may be a need here for a full-scale forensic investigation of what's going on at all. Along the lines that the financial management is inconsistent with the law on one part, but also the HR matters are probably the worst. People are suspended willy-nilly without due process. The Auditor General gave the Road Accident Fund a disclaimer audit opinion, the worst, which it took to court and later withdrew. Now, Scopa wants a detailed response on the issues raised in April and those raised on this oversight visit within 30 days. Ah, the Wem Tila, Pretoria.